first question is uh, actually two or not. Have you ever played in three all the time? Or... Uh, I don't think I played in three. That was probably the most I ever played. Okay. What do you think, you, what do you think uh, went wrong in the first half? Uh, we just came out slow. I mean, we went down 20. Um, so we just, the whole game, we just had to just come out, come from behind. We were just fighting the whole game. So I, I don't know what it was. I mean, it, it really happens a lot to us. We're trying to figure it out, but we always come out <coughs> slow. Because uh, this is the second game in a row. You guys were down double figures in the second half. Yeah. Had to figure out a way to come back. Why, did, why were you guys able to come back? Well, we just... I mean, just played aggressive, just locked up defensively, got stops and made shots. We didn't make any. We couldn't make any shots first half. Uh, we probably shot a terrible field goal percentage uh, in the first half, but the second half we started knocking out shots and playing defense, put it all together. So we came out with the win. Isaac, what do you think helped the team win today? I think in the second half uh, we came out with more energy. And all those conditioning days and everything like that, <laughs> that helped us uh, immensely, I think, tonight. Um, I thought that you might have made the key plays in the game, particularly, uh, let's see. In, I've got too many pages of notes. <laughs> it's a long game. Yeah, well, so <coughs> You had the, uh, you had a, you had a key steal that kind of <coughs> had gone up by eight in the second half, and then you made, you uh, actually, you you finished uh, Dylan's steal. Do you remember that play? Um, ooh, I it was think about eight <laughs> minutes to go, and you had a little run there of a <coughs> free throw. You converted Dylan's steal, and then you made two free throws, and now. He almost lost it. I think he almost lost it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he yeah. Lost the ball. I remember when you talked about <laughs> it. Yeah, it was about the eight minute mark in the second half, and that seemed to kind of, to me, seemed to kind of keep the, the surge going. <coughs> I just tried to um, sh just bring the energy, and I was able to make a few plays. I mean, my teammates, they put me in a good position to make a play, and tonight I was able to uh, do it. Hmm, I'm not I'm not really sure. My brain is pretty fried, so it's hard to remember the, the game, but I guess I just, you know, uh, just try to, you know, make some plays, get some energy. Um, Isaac has some really good assists to me. Uh, just trying to, you know, drive and kick, give me some assists, you know, try to knock down a couple. And uh, Isaac hit a, a pretty, he hit a really good uh, three that uh, I think changed, you know, the game as well. That was a big shot. Um, Basically, it. Um, you guys, how how do you guys <coughs> rely on yourselves to uh, to help make a comeback like this? Because one one person can't come back from nineteen by himself. So what? How do you guys kind of get that uh, uh, energy or, or teamwork to to complete a comeback like this? I think um, like our team chemistry is getting a lot better. You know. Uh, I guess just from spending time, maybe, or I'm not sure, practice, you know, just talking more, being more vocal, and, you know, trusting each other more and more. And uh, I guess it just, I don't know, it just makes it easier for us to play together, you know, as a team. You know, I guess uh, certain players on the floor, you know, they just play comfortably with each other. It's easy to just, you know, build off each other's energy. Whenever somebody either dives on the floor, gets a rebound, makes a big shot, you know, makes a strong play. You, you just feed uh, off of it. At least in the, the games I've seen this sh this season, you might have hit the longest three of the night. <laughs> to give San Jose State its uh, first game of the game. Um, yeah, first game. Of the game. <coughs> Do you remember anything about that shot? I remember it. You know, I just knew I was I was ready to shoot it. I mean, I'm comfortable shooting, you know, pretty far. So it was 
just a regular three to me. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't. I didn't think about it. So, if I remember correctly, the shot clock was was just about done too. Yeah, the shot clock was going down as well. But did you? <coughs> uh, what do you guys? What do you think you guys did defensively in uh, particularly in the last two overtimes? Because they didn't look like they were quite. They didn't have seem to have as much energy as you guys did. Yeah, we just stayed, you know, mentally tough. You know, coach always talk about mentally, being mentally tough, and you know, just playing physical and staying strong. You know, not, you know, showing that you know we're tired, fatigued, uh -huh. and uh, we just fought. You know, kept kept fighting, and you know everybody kept making plays. You know, and uh, we just fed off of it and made some free throws down the stretch, and we had some uh, pretty good defensive stops as well. A couple of rebounds, and I guess it just kept us in the game. And then I guess after a while, I don't know. I guess we just got more mentally tougher towards the end and came up with the win. Sounds good. Thanks.